So I'm checking out the shot here. The whole sequence is cool. Um, I'm actually very curious how you did the camera work in terms of the handheld field and everything. Uh, curious about your workflow because it already looks really, really cool. I think the actions are cool too. I think this all makes good sense here. The only tricky thing is that you're establishing a left to right swing and then is a right to left. So it's kind of an odd break here. And you know, technically, switching angles like that is it just it's just confusing because you change the direction. I know it's technically correct within screen space. Um, what you could do is, you know, you could cheat it where imagine it would be a a bigger turnaround, so that the head here, this guy is a bit further here, bigger bend, the butt is here, so that when he swings, we only get that much that much swing so it keeps a right to left not that you want to start going this way but you just want to just end it just enough so that when you cut it continues that right to left thing here and you might argue that it's like almost then the same angle we're just moving out but which is technically fine because you're going to from a close up to a wide shot I think that's totally fine and then you got the smack here boom that smacks right on impact, which means if you go then right to left, that should be fine. And you're holding this for that. Now, I see what you mean with the ending where you didn't quite know who is finishing. I think that could work. You, would have, you could end on a really cool pose, mouth open, rah, rah, it'd be really cool. Or you show the full on impact, head to head collision, which could be really cool too. So you're having all these you behavior stuff, you got interaction. If this gets too long, um, I think it's fine. I think you should be fine. Because the thing is, the main um, the main impression that I had was that it was too slow, just overall. And I think if you are going to speed this whole thing up twice the speed, let's, let's just pretend, right? So here. That works a lot better. So you imagine you're technically only what, like nine seconds into it instead of 19, nine something. So plow played is twice the speed, makes everything a lot better. And then with that, it gives you more time. I think 10 seconds is a great length for all this action. Because at one point I was thinking, well, at that speed, I don't know, it gets a bit long and you could almost combine the throw down here with the tail. So it's not a down, we hold and wait in this, but it's like a double smack. Ba -ba, right? It's almost you're doing this. Push, and through that throw here, the tail continues and smacks the guys. It's a ba -ba. That could be a cool double whammer. And then back into um, then you could cut it to something like this. You can actually end it like that, right? So hold on, you're doing this, you're doing throw, pound, smack. So it's not this, right? You're not doing this, and you will cut out this shot. You would end here. You would end in this, but it would be coming from this. I'm just saying, <laughs> if you would, if you would think of cutting it shorter, making it a bit different. It would be throw down immediate smack here, which would bring the guy a bit closer to us, a bit bigger here with this guy. And then you could have a bit of a side to side walk for him going away from us and the camera rotating around a bit. So you end up in fact here again. And then that. And again, given that you have now nine seconds, um, I can see how cool it would be to stop and wait for that, right? So the audience goes, oh man, what happened? But I would also love to see how what that would look like if the full on head, head collision there, but but then you would almost have to finish it when they kind of bounce off and boom. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. It could be kind of neat going, boom, cut. Where you just want to feel like, oh, that hurt. And then you cut and you leave the audience going, man, that was so cool. Um, that could work too. But that's it. That's other than that, the major thing to me was speed. 
and then that may know about the camera change here just in terms of screen direction you can keep the rest and everything or if you want to make it slightly different just as an idea a smack boom like a smackdown and tail smack just because double smack like that it's kind of neat it's something maybe unexpected something you haven't really quite seen um and the rest is fine love the camera work again i'm curious what you did with the camera sets uh oh the hand is crypto how did you do the handheld because i have my own little system and and it looks like it's already already in a good spot there and i love this here i love your foreground piece here just for a little bit of moment here and then boom and then it reveals the guy it's cool cool um setup there yeah that's i mean that's all i have it looks already great think about those little changes uh, and then I would say, let's uh, do this. All right, thanks. All right, there's an email. You can sign up, you can start whenever you want, you can submit whenever you want, you get 16 submissions. Either way, a like and subscribe would be awesome. All right, thank you.